I'll take you to Mombasa, where the courts will rule on a matter touching on Mombasa Governor Ali Hassan Joho. Remember that in May this year, Mombasa Governor Hassan Joho obtained orders stopping the police and the director of public prosecutions from arresting, charging and prosecuting him. The court also barred the three state agencies from further interfering in Governor Joho's constitutional rights. The orders were issued pending the hearing and determination of an application by Joho, who sued the Inspector General of Police, Director of Criminal Investigation, Director of Public Prosecutions and Attorney General saying the state was uh, using its resources to intimidate him. And our reporter, Francis Ontomwa, has been following up this story for us. He now joins us live from Mombasa with an update. Francis, um, uh, what was said in court? Well, Akisa, that particular case is supposed to be coming up at around 2.30 p.m. today. So any moment from now, we will be leaving for the Mombasa locals to go and listen uh, to that determination that touches on the governor of Mombasa, Hassan Ali Joho. And as you put it, uh, Hassan Ali Joho at some point moved to court to apply uh, that uh, he stops all investigation investigations by state agencies. And here we are speaking of the Kenya National Examination Council, the Kenya Revenue Authority, and even ESCC and the Directorate of Criminal Investigations from, con from conducting investigations on his profile. Of course, he cited intimidation and state harassment, and that is a matter that uh, they challenged and filed in court, and what will be uh, before the court today for determination to know uh, whether indeed uh, the, 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 his argument holds water or not. And. Uh, Aside from uh, this uh, Joho case that has had a lot of highlight and what many are gluing their eyes and setting their eyes uh, rather on this particular issue, today there was another case in the morning that had a lot of focus, uh, had international focus, and it had to do with the death of uh, a British, uh, British national, uh, Alexander Monson, who died in, the, in May 2012. That is a case, uh, an inquest actually, that was going on and witnesses came forth uh, testifying and giving their account council regarding this matter and it has not been concluded yet there are more witnesses set uh, to appear tomorrow and just to give you a bit of a background alexander monsoon uh, died in 2012 and he died a few hours after he had been taken into custody and there were of course a lot of uh, issues coming around this subject police authorities said he had been intoxicated with uh, drugs he had taken an overdose of uh, drugs and that is why he perished uh, but the family has uh, time and again insisted uh, that he might or he could have been murdered by police authorities. Those police uh, that were involved in this case have stuck to their guns and they have said they were not involved in any way in the murder of Alexander Monson and it could have been an, a drug overdose. So those are two high profile cases that uh, are, were in court and are expected to be in court later in the day and uh, they are issues that we are following closely for you, Akisa. Uh, that 